Hi, it's me Ruth Kwan here and welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you guys are new to my YouTube channel, my name is Kwan, I'm from Thailand and I do study abroad videos, travel videos, scholarship videos and many more. If you guys want to be a part of my journey, be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification bell so you don't miss any of my upcoming content. So in today's video, we are going to talk about how I make portfolio for the scholarship interview which is this one that I'm going to show you soon. So what is portfolio? A portfolio is a folder that consists of your information about your profile, your educational background, the activity that you have participated and all your certificates. So for the student who apply for Turkey bursary scholarship, they usually send an email telling you the date of the interview and inform you about the documents that you have to bring on that day. Usually uh, they will inform you to bring the original document that you have uploaded on the system such as identification card, the original certificates, your diploma, your letter of recommendations. So you have to bring the original one to the interview. So how to make a portfolio? The first one, I want to recommend you to use a hardcover display binder. As you guys can see, I use this one. It's a hardcover binder. It, I use this one because it's practical and as you can see, you can fit all the documents like this for display and it's easy. After that, when you choose the right binder, you will have to make a cover of your portfolio. I use application called Canva to make my cover. I will leave the link in the description box. So the graphic that I made here, uh, I used a template that already exists in Canva and I uh, edit a little bit to suit my preference and suit my style. As you guys can see when you opened the portfolio, the first page that you will see is the table content and then the second page will be the preface. I have to censor it because it's my personal work and then this page is my profile. I put my picture and then a little bit of my information like my hobbies or the languages that I can speak. This another page is my educational background. It consists of the school that I attended since grade 1 to grade 12 and I put a little bit of pictures of my activities. This one is my original document of my uh, diploma and my IELTS test, my IELTS result and then the TOEFL result. This one is all original and also I put my recommendation letter from my teacher. This one is also original one. This page is a preview of the activities. I put certificates, all original. I have to censor it because it's like the signatures. And yeah, basically I just put all the certificates but arrange it into the different groups like French competitions or English competition, something like that. And then I put a graphic which has the preview and my pictures on it. Actually, there are so many ways that you can make a portfolio, but for me, I think this way is the most practical and suitable for the interview because they needed to see the original documents. So put it in a display binder is like the most suitable for me. To make this portfolio, you have to be clean and neat. But for this one, it was a long time ago, so it was not as neat as before. However, it shouldn't be too distracting. It should present all your important information and it should be clean, basically. That's it for the videos. I hope you guys find this video useful. Thank you so much for watching this video and I hope you guys the best of luck. Bye!